30 Years of Service by Chores, which is the Children's Health Organization for Relief and Education Services, is being celebrated. The first visit to Grenada was in August 1989. With the goal of improved health care for Grenadian children, Chores has provided over 20 million US dollars worth of service for free within the last 30 years. Four million US dollars is attributed to cardiac surgeries performed and over a million US dollars in medical equipment donated to ensure the pediatric unit and other units at the General Hospital have state-of-the-art facilities. Several stakeholders and donors were recognized last evening for their yeoman service and contributions to the CHORES mission in Grenada. Dr. Beverly Nelson, who is the coordinator of the CHORES support group, while highlighting and honoring some of the individuals who were instrumental figures, says without their dedication and sacrifice, the 30 years would not have been possible. While this journey has been pure joy, there were some moments of loss and sorrow, and I hope that we spend time this evening acknowledging in our hearts and minds and with our neighbors across the table, the journey, the achievements, and more than that, the community that this project has created. Contractor Eli Rottenberg lost his life when he slid off the General Hospital's roof, which he was trying to repair post Ivan in 2004. I know his spirit is jumping with us tonight. Dr. Nelson credits the efforts of Dr. Douglas Campbell and Dr. Keith Taylor of SGU, along with herself, who paved the way for the telemedicine unit. That patronage continues today as St. George's University provides support on many levels and even further support through the Grenada Heart Foundation. Our friends at the Grenada Heart Foundation must be commended for supporting all our efforts to transfer cardiac candidates to the U.S. for surgery. Without their committed support, the link to surgery would be interrupted. Since the first patient transferred to Wilson Children's Hospital in Jacksonville, Florida, shows have flown out a number of children, including a record six for heart surgeries this year. Joseph McKeesmith, GBN News.